23 years old. He's out. Some very quick thinking by our Velocity Tour team, Jared Groney and our Boot Barn Bullfighters as our PBR Sports Medicine team get in and go right to work and assisting Josh Tucker. Folks, you know, we, we talk about it in the opening. That's why we pray at the beginning of every single Velocity Tour event. It is the most dangerous sport in the world. You know, you're, you're dealing with unscripted, unpredictable elements and now we're going to give him all the assistance that we need, and we appreciate your patience, we appreciate your thoughts, and we appreciate your prayers while we wait to get an update from PBR Sports Medicine on Josh Tucker. It's it's a dangerous thing, you know. No matter where you're competing at, but especially right here at home, when you know that he, when you know that he has family and friends in the crowd watching. But what I can tell you is that they have told me that he is conscious, he is responsive, and he can hear every single one of you right now. PBR Sports Medicine, their number one priority right now is is securing the vertebrae, making sure that it's not a neck injury. That is, uh, that's really the biggest thing right now with the hit that, the kind of hit that Josh Tucker took. We want to make sure that's right, so we're going to put him on the backboard just as a precautionary measure. And I can tell you that Josh Tucker has done some amazing things in his short PBR career, qualifying for the past two years in a row to this championship round in his hometown. He can hear you guys. Josh Tucker. Hang in there. We watch back on the replay. A monster, monster hit. And the way down, it was worse, but just again, a huge testament to your boot farm bullfighters. Jared Groney, your safety man, Matt Merritt, New Darn Entertainer, jumping in, doing everything they can to, to keep that bull distracted and away from our friend Josh Tucker. So listen, Josh Tucker is a bull rider. He's a PBR athlete. He would not want us to stop the night on account of him. He's back there right now. They have a live feed in the sports medicine room. He is going to watch the eight remaining men and cheer them on. Come on, guys. What do you say we make some noise and get back in it? And